Hello everyone and welcome back to The Rundown, your quick stop for the biggest entertainment news you might have missed last week from the Front Row Network on NPR Illinois. It was Comic Con at Home week last week and that means the news, well, it comes fast and furious. If you want some more detailed breakdowns of every single day of the con, look back at our daily recap videos. But for this episode, I'll recap the biggest news that came out of all of the panels and some other news that dropped this week outside of the Comic Con at Home virtual event. Disney has announced that Mulan's release has officially been delayed indefinitely in the light of the continuing coronavirus pandemic. Disney has also pushed back the release dates of the next Star Wars and Avatar films. At the companion virtual convention JusticeCon, director Zack Snyder revealed that his upcoming HBO Max cut of Justice League is using unseen footage from the original production and will include new scenes filmed with the principal cast. He also announced that there will not be a single frame of what Joss Whedon filmed in his final cut. Some big news came out of the Bill and Ted Face the Music panel. First, the film is now shifting to a simultaneous theatrical and VOD release, now slated for September 1st, 2020, and more shockingly, original co-star and deceased comedy icon George Carlin will be making an appearance in the film in some way, though there is no word on how that will be accomplished at this time. At their panel, the Long and Limbo New Mutants announced that they are, and at the current time, still sticking to their August 28, 2020 release date, despite director and writer Josh Boone saying that he'd be good with a VOD release as well. At the panel for the new horror film Antlers, Oscar winner Guillermo del Toro said he has found the silver bullet for beginning filming on his new film Nightmare Alley. Del Toro said he's done some creative working and scheduling to get the production up and running in the midst of the pandemic. And finally, a ton of television series updates. The Boys has been already renewed for season three at Amazon before their season two premiere in September. Phoebe Waller-Bridge has joined the cast of season two of His Dark Materials on HBO. Nickelodeon announced a brand new Star Trek show called Star Trek Prodigy and Discovery released that season three will be premiering on time. And finally, The Walking Dead for the first time will not release a new season in October. Season 11 has been delayed due to the pandemic, but the current season 10 has been given six brand new episodes to release starting in October of 2020. With all the news from Comic-Con, we still did also lose some of true legends last week. Television megastar Regis Philbin died at the age of 88. Philbin holds the Guinness record for the most time logged on live television and was a giant of pop culture. We also lost cult acting icon John Saxon at the age of 83. A true jack of all trades with cinematic styles, Saxon is most remembered for his villainous role in Bruce Lee's Enter the Dragon and as Nancy's father in the original Nightmare on Elm Street. And finally, Hollywood royalty Olivia de Havilland died at the age of 104. One of the first female stars of the classic Hollywood world, de Havilland came to fame with performances in The Adventures of Robin Hood and Gone with the Wind. She also won a landmark lawsuit against Warner Brothers that helped do away with the restrictive contract system in Hollywood. Let's close it out with a very quick run through of the new trailers we got from Comic-Con last week. Bill and Ted Face the Music released their second trailer and will release as stated on September 1st. New Mutants gave a look at the first two minutes of the film and a new trailer during their panel and is still set for release on August 28th. Scott Cooper's new monster horror film Antlers released their latest trailer and are set for a February 21st, 2021 release. And finally, a ton of new television trailers were dropped, including season six of Fear the Walking Dead, the new spin off show The Walking Dead World Beyond, His Dark Material Season 2, Lovecraft Country on HBO, the Marvel Universe Hulu series Hellstrom, and Amazon's new paranormal comedy Truth Seekers from the comedy duo of Simon Pegg and Nick Frost. Thanks for checking out The Rundown. For more from the Front Row Network, including all of our dozens of shows and our articles and interviews, visit nprillinois.org or search for us on Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram with the Front Row Network, and follow us on Twitter at Front Row Reviews with a Z.